Hi, welcome to SBR Videos. I'm Peter Loshak. We are previewing week 13 in the NFL. We're talking right now with Troy West from AllPlaysWin.com. And Troy West has a long-term record of success uh, in the NFL. That's 57% last year. He was killing it uh, before last year. This year, he's up around 57% again. And uh, how's he doing recently, you ask? 7-0-1 against Fred over the last two weeks. Hasn't given us a loser uh, since three weeks ago. Troy West, thanks for being back with us. Hey, thanks a lot, Pete. It's just been a hell of a run. It's in this run. I keep thinking we're going to have a losing weekend. At some point, we're due to lose, and then we don't lose. Uh, this, I mean, I'm a realist over here, but mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, we have constantly won week in and week out, and that's both sports. That's college football and the NFL. We've just been absolutely outstanding. Come take a look, allplayswin.com. Pete, I'll give you a free weekend. I'll give you what it takes to earn our business. We've been outstanding. Really encourage people to come take a look. Best in customer service. And right now, you're not going to find another Catholic service that's capping games like we are. All right, well, 7-0-1 against spread last two weeks. So you're red hot Troy West right now. And uh, Denver KC is the second NFL game you're going to cover this week. Right now, KC is a one or one and a half point home dog. And that line has uh, been bet a little bit. It opened to pick them. So some money came in on Denver. And, you know, Denver... Just beat Miami at home last week, fourth quarter comeback, uh, but they lost against the spread, and Denver's now lost three out of four against the spread. Casey is uh, off the long week and the outright loss to Oakland, and Denver can lose uh, as good as they are, as awesome and unstoppable as Peyton Manning seems at times. They can lose to a decent teams on the road. They have outright losses uh, at Seattle, at New England, and, um, and at St. Louis, and uh, they have uh, uh, road wins against lesser teams. The question is, is Casey on that level? Yeah, they probably are, and if so, then uh, maybe they have value as a home dog here, but then the question is, why did the line get bet to uh, where it did? What's your take on this game, Troy? You know, Pete, you know, Denver has been extremely vulnerable, and they, they've shown a lot of weaknesses over the last couple of weeks. Teams can run the football, and they even can set up and throw the football. Dan Hill looked good. Sean Hill looked good. Two very average quarterbacks. Alex Smith, another pretty average quarterback, but will he have success is the big question mark. I think Alex Smith's going to get his yards, but Pete, I'll tell you, I just can't back this Kansas City team. I wouldn't mm. watch the, an 0-10 Oakland Raider team with Derek Carr go in and really exploit this Kansas City defense. I think the line's where it's at because it's in KC. It's a division rival game. Kansas City's got a great running back in Jamal Charles. I think they think that he's going to have a big game, which he might, but in the end, Pete, I've got a rule. Peyton Manning is an underdog. I'm going to circle that, and I'm going to take that every single time, and I think I'm going to win seven or eight out of ten times as Peyton Manning as a dog or even at a pick game. So my biggest thing, Denver's still finding ways to win games. They really looked good in that second half against Miami. They got the win. They looked damn near unstoppable. They looked like the Denver of old with that offense clicking at the end of that game. They put up 38 on a really good Miami defense beat. I think they're going to have a great week. I think I think Denver, in the end, gets it done and wins this football game. All right. Well, Denver's not actually a dog here. They're a minus one right now. But, uh, you know, Casey's off a long week. And before their game last week, they were, they've been 8-2 and two against the spread and uh, in their 10 games before that. And, you know, Casey has a traditionally one of the strongest uh, home field advantages in all the NFL. And, again, Denver has shown that they can lose uh, when they're going on the road against uh, quality teams who have good uh, home field advantages. You don't think that's the case here? No, I don't think it's the case here, Pete. I, I really don't. You know that you know me, Pete. A couple weeks ago, I had Kansas City at home against the Seahawks. Sure. That was one of my top plays of the year. So I'm not afraid to go against Kansas City at home. I just think Denver right now, I know they're struggling a little bit, but I think they get things going again. Kansas City just looks so bad. They've had to sit on such a bad loss now. I know it's a long week. They've had time to get over it. But I think Peyton Manning's going to have a hell of a day on Sunday night against his Kansas City team. Got to go with, got to go with Denver here. All right, minus one is the currently uh, widely available line. Troy West liking Denver minus one over KC. Thanks so much, Troy. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns, big money free betting contests year round, a real time Vegas style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.